struggle to touch your toes and feel like your hamstrings are inhibiting your range of motion, well, save this video. We're gonna be going over four different exercises with a band that will help you increase your mobility, flexibility, and hopefully get you to touch your toes. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe, turn on the notifications bell, and leave a comment below. All right, we're gonna get started. All you're gonna need is a one inch thick band. This is a Rogue Fitness band. You can check them out in the link below and grab yours. We're gonna start by going onto our backside. So the first exercise is gonna be a band and hamstring stretch. So I'm gonna lay on my back. I'm gonna start with my left leg up. I'm gonna place the band in the arch of my foot. I wanna make sure it's slightly underneath the balls of my feet. Opposite leg's nice and straight. Hands are gonna be the base of the band here. And we're gonna do a 30 second to 45 second, three, two, one. So if you're newer, start with 30 seconds. If you're more experienced, if you have been doing a good amount of stretching, go to the 45 seconds or even 60 seconds, one minute. So here are the first exercise. Leg is nice and long. If this is too much for you, take the one side of the band off so you can actually get that leg to be straight. If at any point it's too much, you can always slightly bend the knee. But we're gonna do a three, two, one. So I'm gonna pull my band, push my leg away from me for three, two, one, and then I'm gonna release, and then I'm trying to pull a little bit higher, keeping the leg as straight as possible. If this is near impossible, you can do a slight bend, or again, take the strap off. Again, you're gonna continue through this flow, three, two, one, for the 30 to 45 seconds. So you'll do your left leg, then you'll switch, and go to the right leg. Same thing, opposite leg, nice and long, and continue through that three, two, one. Then, second exercise is gonna be specific to this banded IT band stretch. So we'll go back to the left leg. You are now gonna drop your leg across your body only as far as the butt cheeks are still in contact with the ground. So if you feel like you're rolling off and your butt's coming off of the floor, then roll back slightly. You should feel this depending on how tight you are on the outside of your leg here, hamstring plus the IT band. Same thing, we're gonna repeat that. We're gonna do a three, two, one, push, pull for that three, two, one, and then you're releasing it, try to pull a higher. Note that if you pull your toes back towards you and you drive your heel towards that wall or the ceiling, you'll feel that a little more in the calf. So note if you want more calf stretch, do that. Again, three, two, one, then we'll switch. Same thing on the opposite side. Then we'll come back to that leg. Third exercise, we're gonna drop the leg to the outside angle here. So I'm trying to keep my leg as high as I can in my face while still maintaining my hips and not rolling off to the side like so. So just like before, we'll do a three, two, one. This may be a little bit easier as you have a little more range of motion. Three, two, one, we're gonna pull myself a little higher. This is gonna target hamstring, but also more of the adductor here. That's the third exercise. Fourth exercise, remember, do the other leg. I'm gonna bend my leg and I'm gonna do a figure four. You don't have to keep the band on here, you can take it off. I personally like this to use it as it allows me to hold my foot. A couple different options here. I can, one, Press my thigh away, avoid the knee. Press the thigh away, right, working the hip stretch. That's one option. Second option, I can lift that leg up, right, using the band to pull my knee up, and then using my knee or my thigh to press into my foot here. So again, that's the other option. Third option here, right, take the band out. I can take my hands and interlock in the base of the hamstring here, and then pull that leg, foot to my body. I can even grab kind of the base, of the sh or top of the shin here, base of the knee, if I'm very flexible. I'm really tight, but you guys can see this position that I'm creating figure four. So you're gonna do that same thing, 30 seconds on that leg, then you'll switch, or 45 seconds, and you'll switch to the other leg. Now, that is one full round of today's stretching. If you feel like that was ample and you're good, check that box, move on, come back to this video later. If you want more, I would suggest doing two rounds of that, starting from that first banded exercise, moving to the IT band, then adductor, and then figure four. Again, getting to touch your toes is going to be a process. It's not just gonna happen overnight, but hamstring mobility is a big component that does contribute to your flexibility or lack of flexibility. If you found this beneficial, I would love for you to share with others. Leave a comment below if you've done these before, if you haven't, and what other content you would like to see. I appreciate you tuning in. Again, any support that you guys can offer, whether it's subscribing, sharing, or checking out the links below, I greatly appreciate it. Stay tuned for more.